Hey guys, it's Michelle. Wanted to share something with you that I had done um, day before yesterday and I'm hoping it helps and I'm wondering if any of you guys have had this done or not. Before I start this video, just to uh, get too far into it, I'm gonna let you know I'm not recommending that anyone do this. You should always consult a doctor before you do anything to your body or do anything medical or do any piercings or tattoos or anything else. I am not supporting you doing it. I am not recommending that you do it. This is just about me, okay? But I want to know if any of you guys have had this done. I am a migraine sufferer. I have been since I was 15 years old. And um, I've had a couple of friends tell me in the past couple of years about Dave piercing. And I had both of my ears done day before yesterday. Now I'm going to try to show you this in the video, but since I can't really tilt my head in an awkward way so I can see it at the same time, I'll just try to show you this teeny weeny little silver bar with the teeny weeny little silver balls right through here. That is my day piercing on my left ear. And then this is the one on my right ear. I hope you guys can see that. Um, hope you can't see too far into my ear. You might see what's left of my brain. But anyway, <laughs> I had my day piercings done and I'm really, really hoping that this helps with my migraines. My migraines are caused by uh, food allergies and food combinations like I'm not supposed to have red wine and uh, citrus fruit and fresh baked bread and processed meat and cheeses and peanut butter and all the good things in life. There, there's even pickled herring on the list of things I'm not supposed to have, but I don't think that's a problem. <laughs> I don't see me running out to get that anytime soon. But um, there's a lot of things that if I have those combinations of foods, then I will get a migraine within like a day. I also have some stress migraines. Um, so I went ahead and had it done on both sides because my migraines are centrally located. Um, sometimes they're above my right eye, but usually they're right in the middle or at the base of my neck. And um, so I had heard about Dave piercing and uh, I pulled it up here on my laptop. I want to read something to you guys really quick. This is from the migrainebuddy.com website. It says, um, Basically, the piercing is done on a very specific area of the ears called the daith, a small fold of cartilage in the inner ear, just above the ear canal, which I just showed you mine. I can just barely see it. Oh, there we go. Now I can see it at the same time. Um, skipping ahead to the next paragraph, it, well, right there it says it can take up to months to heal and can easily become infected if not cared for or pierced correctly or accurately. The underlying theory behind this piercing is a migraine treatment can be acquainted with a Chinese medical practice known as acupuncture. In this case, the vital point at the date is supposedly aligned with the digestive system. And if your migraines are related to digestive problems, there's a possibility that date piercings could be your fix. Um, Western medicine and practices are still skeptical about the ability and just a mere ear piercing to treat such a tricky and unpredictable disease like migraines. There's no data on day piercings available in the scientific literature, at least at this time. And that's from migrainebuddy.com from their website. Um, but anyway, I have friends that I've had it done and they say it's worked quote unquote miracles for them. And so I thought I'd give it a shot. If nothing else, I think the piercings look kind of cool. But uh, I'm trying to take good care of them and keep them clean and free of infection. And um, um, I'll keep you guys updated to let you know how they work for me. I did have a small headache yesterday. Uh, lasted, gosh, maybe an hour, if that. And I was under some pretty heavy-duty stress at the time. So um, I think that may have just been my body getting used to it, too. So who knows? But we'll see if they work or not. And... Um, Apparently Ella needs me because she's scratching and you can probably hear that. That's pretty loud. So I'm going to go. Let me know in the comments down below if you've had it done or if you know somebody has and if it worked for them. I'm just curious. Again, I'm not recommending that anyone do this. Uh, we'll talk again about life and love and shoes and shopping and whatever pops into my head, such as earrings. <laughs> you guys, please join me. If you haven't subscribed, join down below. As soon as I get to 100 subscribers, I'm going to have a huge giveaway. So I want you guys to get in on that. Have a blessed day. Bye.